What's good YouTube? Welcome to my channel. If you're back from the previous videos I uploaded, thank you, I really appreciate you guys. If you could like and subscribe to the channel, I'd really appreciate that too. Now I'm back with a new pickup for you guys today. Um, this is the Nike Air Force One Low Beach colorway. Well, that's what it was advertised on the sneakers app as. I know I've seen a lot of people are calling it coconut milk, which is part of the colorway, I think. Um, I didn't bother trying to get these on the sneakers app. I, I noticed they did sell out straight away anyway, but I was focusing more on the um, the cool grey free, which I showed you in my last video. And obviously trying to get two at the same time, it's near on impossible to get one, so to get two. By the time you've got the one or done the purchasing process and tried to get back to this one, there's no chance anyway. So, um, But I managed to get these the same night on uh, the size app. Um, I think they're pretty much sold out everywhere now, so um, yeah, I was I was happy to get them to be honest because this is one I was really excited about. I haven't bought a Nike Air Force One in a long time, other than the pure white. Um, I've had a lot of Nike Air Forces in my time, but none of the big, big, you know, the big releases they did ones that people go crazy about. And I know not a lot of people go crazy about the the Air Force ones because it's all about the Jordan ones and the. Um, the dunks and the SB dunks, you know, a lot of hype around them, uh, them traders these days. But I love the Nike Air Force One, and to be honest, I'm not really bothered about hype. I just buy shoes that I like. Um, some of these hype shoes that I don't like, I wouldn't even try and buy them just to say that I had them. I'm, that's not the type of collector I am. Um, so yeah, let's let's have a look at these bad boys. Um, I was excited about these because the colorway for me is perfect like i love that neutral type of um colorway that like kanye does on a lot of the um the 500s like just like you know the sail and the sand love that and um, one thing i noticed about the paper on this which i think is a really nice little touch it's got the stars um that we see on the um the toe and the sole of the air force ones and i think they have it on the do they have, yeah i think they have it on the toe of the jordan ones and the fours i think they might have it on other ones you'll have to let me know in the comments i'm not too sure but off the top of my head they're the ones i can think of um and i don't know if this is something they've just done for this shoe or something they're doing a lot of what air forces these days because like i said i haven't bought a pair of air forces in a long time other than the pure whites and i don't think that's got the stars on the paper i'm sure i would have noticed it but um yeah, let me know in the comments if this is something they're doing these days because I just thought it was a really nice little touch having the stars on the paper there on the tissue. Now, these are, to me, absolutely um, fire. Like, these are an amazing, amazing colorway absolutely perfect for me i mean you can't go wrong with the white on whites the all whites anyone who's into sneakers shoes trainers whatever you want to call them i'm sure will always reload um on the whites because they crease easy and they get dirty easy because they're white so i'm sure everybody has them on rotation but this from what i've seen myself and maybe i've missed a few but it's probably the best air force i've seen come out in a while um i just think it's absolutely perfect the colorways and like the different textures and materials they've used on this shoe it's crazy like you've got the tumbled leather here on the toe box you've got this shaggy suede i think they call it shaggy suede around the toe and on the upper here and at the back tab got that shaggy suede um, normal leather here normal suede on the swoosh here and here the normal white midsole that you get on the white air forces and sole um, this mesh on the tongue with this stitching under the Nike Air logo which you also have up the back here which I just think all of it together is is unreal and i think the colorways on this i think they call it sail um, and coconut milk or something which, which to be fair when i look at these i can see why they say that 
Um, but what an absolute amazing, amazing shoe. I think they're absolutely beautiful. Let me know in the comments what you guys are thinking about these. But for me, these are absolute fire. Um, I'll be really, really worried about getting these dirty though, because I can imagine cleaning this shaggy suede is going to be an absolute nightmare. So, although I like can't wait to bust these out as soon as we're allowed, because at the minute we're still on the national lockdown in the UK. So as soon as we're like actually allowed out, you know, to bars and restaurants and whatnot, um, I'm really, really looking forward to wearing these. To be honest, I really am. Um, yeah. Just an absolutely great shoe. Um, these released, what was it, last Saturday? So yeah, yeah, because it was the same time I was trying to buy the Cool Greys. These released on 20 February, 2021. Um, but yeah, other than the fact I absolutely love them, there's not much more I can say about them other than what an amazing shoe. And let me know in the comments what you guys are thinking. But for me, absolutely perfect they nailed it they absolutely nailed it um i have seen another air force that's coming up i think it's coming out up on the is it the 9th of march i think this year um the popcorns i don't know if you guys have seen them but they look crazy i think already on the um i think i've seen them on Foot Locker. they've got the popcorn um mids blazers the, the popcorn mid blazers um, which look crazy to be fair but the, the air forces look even better so as soon as they come out i'm praying to get my hands on a pair of them um but yeah that is the nike air force one low beach or coconut milk definite favorite of mine at the minute definitely one of my favorites um yeah brilliant shoe So, as always guys, I'm um, going to try my hardest to keep um, bringing you guys content. Um, I hope you're enjoying the videos as much as I'm enjoying making them. Um, like I said, in the UK at the minute, we're, in a, we're on a national lockdown, so these videos are keeping me going, to be honest. We can't even go to the barbers and get our hair cut, hence why I'm wearing a hat in every single video. If I was to take this hat off, it would be ugly, trust me. Um, so yeah, thank you so much guys for coming and giving me a watch once again. Um, take care of yourselves until next time. <laughs>